Hello, Nomad Sculpt, and this video is about um, export with transparency. Um, so it's nice to know. So, <laughs> okay, so first we need an example. So here, this sphere, there are no textures, it's only a vertex paint. So I painted. Um, with a less opacity uh, here you can change the in intensity of the opacity so you can paint here a little bit so I paint here a little bit darker and here with a hundred percent opacity so yeah and now I try to export this as a GLTF file, vertex colors here um, and PBR paint and I export it. I save it to the files and I save it. So I replace the other file. Okay, so now here is an online viewer for the uh, 3D files. So I drag and drop this file here and you see here there's no transparency on the object okay so back to nomad the sphere has the material set to opaque so opaque doesn't support um, transparency I don't know um, so for the export or something and I think dithering also not the other uh, materials you, you have to check so you when you want to export transparency material you have to set it to blending so here at the moment the opacity slider is at 100% um, so Let's test it with this setting, export, save to files, okay, so back to the online viewer and pick the new file and drag and drop it. So. I can't see my brain <laughs> so yeah so let's test it again so let's use the opacity slider a little bit export GLTF So this is the first time we see a little bit of transparency. So, yeah, but the problem is, <laughs> um, yeah, we want uh, on the rest of the mesh 100% um, opacity. So, yeah, let's try other things. So, we set it to blending at the moment, this is okay. And the next thing is we use uh, the texture baking, opacity, color, okay. And let's bake textures. So now we have an opacity map here, okay. So let's export with textures. Back to the viewer. So now 
we have the opacity like we want it. Um, the object is opaque and the transparent materials are correct. So yeah, this is a way <laughs> to get the transparency working. And so here with the same setting we try to export it um, as an OBJ file. Um, layers and extra painting, roughness, metalness and masks mask will be lost. So I think also the transparency is lost because when we export it as uh, OBJ So I sip it and back to the viewer. So I drag drop the zip file. So no transparency. Uh, so here you see we have a opacity map here, but it I think it's ignored or something. So if somebody has a um, knows how to get uh, OBJ files with transparency, um, it would be nice to know how it works. So, yeah, that's it. Have fun with sculpting. Ciao.